what are we expecting then from Truss's big speech today? Well, Anna, defiant is the tone that Liz Truss is going to try and strike today. She'll say that she's going to get on with her policies, regardless of whether it makes her unpopular. But it's going to be a bit eyebrow-raising, given that this conference started with that massive U-turn on the top rate of income tax cut. And at the other end of the spectrum now, we're hearing lots of division within Cabinet about what to do on benefits. Truss has hinted that she wouldn't stick to Boris Johnson's commitment to raise benefits benefits in line with inflation because she needs to save money to pay for her tax cuts and also perhaps she would see it as a way to incentivize people into work. Now it's controversial given of course we're in a cost of living crisis. On, on the main welfare payment 38% of people are actually in work but I've asked lots of cabinet ministers what they would do and it really makes them squirm. Take a listen to this. There will be discussions about the way forward on commitments like benefits. Naturally, there is then also the decision to be taken about benefits operating. This is one for me to take in my role. I can't tell you here and now uh, what that will be. There's a statutory, a legal process that the DWP secretary uh, and other ministers go through each year. That will just happen in the normal, the normal way. And it is right that they look at what the pressures are, what's the right uh, level to peg those benefits at. We have not yet reached a decision on that. And this government will always help people get on in life whilst making sure the most vulnerable are protected. So no clear decision yet on benefits, even though they've made the commitment to raise pensions in line with inflation, and it risks stoking not just divisions in the party, but also in the country, underscoring this uh, image of the Conservatives as governing for the rich and widening the gap between the Tories and Labour.